multi-factor authentication, which provides enhanced gateway security for administrator access to the gateway, is now available. After you log in with your admin username and password, on the system page of the overview section, you might notice a recommendation to turn on this new feature. To turn on the feature, go to the administrator access page. However, before you can turn on two-factor authentication, email addresses and phone numbers must be configured for all administrators. You do this on the administrators page. Enter the email address and the phone number in the given fields. We highly recommend that you use the new test button to make sure the correct email and phone numbers were entered. To complete the test, check your email and your phone to see if you received the test messages. After an email address and phone number is configured for all administrators, you can go back to the administrator access page to enable two-factor authentication. You can use the link. When two-factor authentication is enabled, it forces all administrators to use a second factor on top of their password when logging into the gateway through the web UI portal or by SSH, and even when logging in via a direct console connection. The second factor can be obtained in one of three ways, email, SMS, or an Authenticator app, such as Google Authenticator or Microsoft Authenticator. When you select the box to enable two-factor authentication and click Save, at this point an email containing instructions for using the Authenticator app and emergency keys will be sent to the email address of the connected administrator. Check your email for this message, which contains important information and instructions. You are asked to confirm you received the email.